Gregorian Cup finalist Avangard Omsk lace him up against Abdemobilist. Joffrey Lupul is back in the lineup for this one. Things didn't go so well for Abdemobilist though. Midway through the first, Avangard gets in on a 3-on-2 rush on the power play. Thomas Zaborski passes to Dmitry Semen, and it goes in 1-0 Omsk. Semen has been productive lately. That's his fifth goal in the past five games and seventh of the season. Dying seconds of the second now, Edward Rezvik makes a couple of huge saves for Avangard. The play goes the other way. Anton Kuryanov and Andrei Ivanov storm forward, saucer pass, and it's 2-0 Omsk. What a sequence. After Ambilis could have tied it right before the intermission, but instead they got scored on. That ruins your confidence just like that. Just over six minutes into the third now, Sergei Kostitsin has the puck behind the net, drops for Alex Frolov, and he surprises Chris Holt with another goal, 3-0 Avangard. They say that Avangard didn't sign any big names during the NHL lockout. But hey, Kostitsin is a terrific addition to their team. That's his 10th assist, and he has 16 points in 14 games, and he has a plus 11 rating. And how about this, 21-year-old Rezovic gets his second shutout in a row as he sobs 31 shots in this one. Lupo played over 20 minutes of ice time, had 3 shots and was minus 2. After the game he said he needs to adjust to a bigger ice surface. Yeah, no kidding. With the departure of Evander Kane from Dynamo Minsk, we know it's not easy. 3-0 Avangard final.